Hello children, good morning. How are you? How are you doing? Are you helping your parents at home? Are you studying? Hope you all are keeping yourself safe at home. Today, we are going to learn about alphabets. I'm going to sing a rhyme for you. Please sing along with me. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, O, M, N, O, P, L, O, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z, X, Y, Z, sugar on the bread. If you don't like it, better go to bed. Next Monday morning, come to me. I will teach you A, B, C. So, today we are going to learn <coughs> how to write the capital letters A. A for? A for? I know you like apple, red color apple. A for apple. So, we are going to write A. A slanting line. One more slanting line. And a sleeping line. Next letter A. A slanting line. One more slanting line. And a sleeping line. Next letter A. A slanting line. Another slanting line. And a sleeping line. Next letter A. B for boy. B for boy. Now we are going to write letter B. A standing line, a curve, another curve. Next, letter B. A standing line, a curve, another curve. Next, letter B. A standing line, a curve, another curve. Next, letter B. <clears throat> now, C for cat. C for cat. Now, we are going to learn how to make the letter C. A big curl is letter C. A curl makes letter C. A curl makes letter C. C. C for cat. D for dog. D for dog. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter D. A standing line and a curve makes letter D. A standing line and a curve makes letter D. A standing line and a curve makes letter D. D for dog. Now E. E for elephant. E for elephant. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter E. A standing line. A sleeping line. One more sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter E. A standing line, a sleeping line, another sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter E. A standing line, a sleeping line, 
another sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter E. Now F for fish. F for fish. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter F. A standing line, a sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter F. A standing line, a sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter F. A standing line and a small standing line. Sleeping line and a small sleeping line makes letter F. F for fish. F for fish. Now we are going to learn the letter G. G for girl. G for girl. Now we are going to write G. A curve. A standing line. A small sleeping line. And one more small standing line. Makes letter G. A curve, a standing line, a small sleeping line and a standing line makes the letter G. A curve, a standing line, a small standing line, another standing line makes the letter G. H, H for hen, H for Hen. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter H. A standing line, a small sleeping line and a standing line makes the letter H. A standing line, a small sleeping line, another standing line makes the letter H. A standing line, a small sleeping line, another standing line makes the letter H. H for hen. I for, do you know what is I for? I for ice cream. We all like to have ice cream. I know most of you also are fond of ice cream. So now we are going to write the letter I. A standing line, a small sleeping line up here and a small sleeping line up here makes the letter I. A standing line, a small sleeping line out here and a small sleeping line out here makes the letter I. A standing line and a small sleeping line and a small sleeping line out here makes the letter I. I for ice cream. Now J for. J for joker. J for joker. Now we are going to write the letter J. A sleeping line. A standing line, a small curve makes the letter J. A sleeping line, a standing line with a small curve makes the letter J. A standing line, a sleeping line, a standing line with a small curve at the end makes the letter J. J for joker. J for Joker. K. Now K for, you know, what is K for? K 
Cape for kites. Cape for kites. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter K. A standing line, a cross line up and a cross line down makes the letter K. A standing line, a cross line up and a cross line down makes the letter K. A standing line with a cross line up and a cross line down makes the letter K. K for kites. K for kites. L. L for lion. L for lion. You have seen L for lion in the zoo. Yes. We have seen the TV, so we are going to write the letter L. Here we go. A standing line and a sleeping line makes the letter L. A standing line and a sleeping line makes the letter L. A standing line and a sleeping line makes the letter L. L for lion. L for lion. M for mango. Now summers are coming. We love to eat mango. I also love to eat mango. You also love to eat mango? M for mango. Now we are going to learn how to write the letter M. A stand, a standing line. Cross line down and a cross line up with a standing line. We make the letter M. A standing line with a cross line or a slanting line and one more slanting line with a standing line is called this letter M. A standing line with a slanting line, one more slanting line, and a standing line makes letter M. M for mango. So, kids, I was very happy once more to come to teach you the letters capital letters which you have forgotten. I hope so you have not forgotten but thus this is a brush up for you. Hope so we we'll meet you soon. Thank you.